unprecedented power and the versatility of being a completely wireless solar light. Look no further than the Eco Wedge Elite. With this 60 SMD high powered 1000 lumen light, this light can be completely manned by a remote control and you can even keep it running on a steady glow from dusk till dawn. My name is Zoe, I work at the Solar Center and today we are going to be unboxing and telling you everything you need to know about this Eco Wedge Elite. And if you stick along till the end of this video, I'll even give you a promo code to make sure that you are getting some pennies off. So like, subscribe, and let's get to unboxing. So here are some interesting features that'd be good to know if you're considering buying this product. Number one is just how bright this solar security light is. It packs an enormous 1000 lumen punch which makes it perfect for lighting up those larger driveways. Not only that, the PIR sensor has a 10 meter detection range. And as you can see, it's completely self-contained. Not only that, this light comes with a very compact infrared remote control, giving you eight meters of detection from the remote control to the solar light. The remote control lets you turn the light on and off remotely, as well as changing it to any of the five modes. So let's see what's inside the box. So in the box, we have the instructions, we have the remote control and the light itself, as well as some screws for installation and a cardboard template. So you know exactly where to screw the screw holes in to make sure it's perfectly aligned with the back of the solar light. The pack of two screws includes two wall plugs as well. You can mount it to any fence or garden wall that you might need. Installing the light is incredibly simple. You simply line up those two screws with the holes in the template, screw everything into place, and then just slot the light over it. And I'm gonna show you now how the light works. So there's an on button on the unit itself, and when you press it, the light is automatically going to go to mode one. As soon as mode one is on, a yellow LED will turn on on the light, indicating that it is in mode one. So mode one is the low light mode, and that means that as soon as it gets dark, this light will be on on a low power mode. And then as soon as motion is detected, it's gonna flash on to its full 1000 lumens for approximately 15 seconds. After that, it reverts back to the low power mode. If you want to change the mode, you can either press the on off button again or revert to the remote control where the remaining five buttons give you the options to flick between modes. If you press mode two, a blue light will come on. This mode is the one that we recommend for winter use and essentially what it will do is it will stay off even after darkness and it will only activate when motion is detected. As soon as motion is detected, it then goes to its full brightness mode of a thousand lumens for 15 seconds, after which it switches back off again. Then if you press mode three, a red light will come on and this mode will keep your light on a medium brightness so you can use it as a standard wall lamp. As soon as it gets dark, the light will switch on and it will remain on a medium brightness. It doesn't increase or deplete if motion is detected, it just stays on a steady medium brightness until it runs out of battery or 10 hours have passed. Mode four will be indicated by a yellow, blue and red light. So the way that this mode works is after dusk, the light will illuminate to a medium brightness. That is until it drops below 40% and then it will automatically switch to mode two, which is the winter mode in which it will stay off until motion is detected and then you'll get that bright burst of light. If you select this mode and the Evo Elite is already below 60%, it will just revert back to mode two. And finally, mode five will be indicated by the yellow, blue and red flashing LEDs on the side of the Evo Elite. And what this mode does is it allows the light to illuminate at full brightness 1000 lumens for one hour, after which it's gonna switch itself off. So just so it's clear, mode one to four are only going to work as soon as the solar panel detects darkness. Mode five can be used in the daytime. We also don't recommend mode one, three and four for winter use. Your light is gonna be much more effective on mode two. So let's talk dimensions. The light is 210 millimeters in length. It's 140 millimeters in height. Screw holes are 115 millimeters apart. And the view from the side is 115 millimeters by 140 millimeters. The color of this light is a white. The bulbs are white SMD. And the remote control includes batteries as well as the light itself. These are already installed for you. 
This light is also incredibly weather resistant with an IP waterproofing rating of 65. It detects motion up to 10 meters away. And if you want to check that this light is on, as soon as you press the on button on the remote, you should see a yellow LED on the light itself, indicating that though it's switched off, it is charging. And that is everything you need to know about the Evo SMD Elite. It's incredibly powerful. It definitely packs a punch. And it also gives you this incredible versatility as both a wall light, a welcome light, and and a solar security light. So if you have any questions about this light that I haven't answered, just comment them down below and I'll get back to you with the answers anyway. While you're down there, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. It makes all the difference. We'd be very grateful. And if you're looking for that promo code, I've left it in the description below. So make sure you have a look at that too. Thank you very much for watching and we will see you on the next one.